Hello everybody and welcome back to Kind Seed. Today we're going to try and get that scythe for our family and then we will see what else we can do. Hopefully explore the barrel grounds because we didn't get to explore it a lot before we passed out. Oh, I love the music right now. Oh, there you are, blacksmith! You did it! Well, a promise is a promise. Are you ready to learn the noble art of smithing? Use the chain on the forger there to begin. Uh, oh, a sickle mold. A mold used for blacksmithing. <laughs> hey, you raining! Smiths don't have to be depressing. By Anvil. Nice. Welcome, blacksmith. If you're reading this, then you have likely purchased your own smithy. Hot hours of toil, bending the elements to your will lay ahead. Smithing is a smoky art. It is a labor of love, sweat, and giving things a good hammering. To help you out on the journey into the world of iron and muscle, I have forged this book. Well, I've written it. To begin, the basics. There are multiple types of ore you can mine. Use these combined with a mold to create your own works. Customers will come into your shop and either ask for something off your shelves or request orders. Some customers are more patient than others, so if you need more time, just yell at them from the forge. They will understand. When you finish crafting an item, you can send it to the shelf or to your order cabinet. You can also turn old, unsold, or un unwanted items back into their base material. But this process can go wrong and you may lose it. It is recommended that two people run a smithy, one for the shop and one for the forge. Someone charming is better place selling and someone strong is better fit for crafting. Do not forget to use your ledger to set opening hours, check accounts, hire and fire, and order in stock. At the end of the day, do not forget to interact with the sign to close up. Oh cool, so that's for when we're old enough to like actually buy shops and make this place ours. <laughs> Take over the economy, one building at a time. Okay chain? Okay, let's begin your smithing apprenticeship. Start by selecting an ore and a mold. You only have a tan and a sickle mold, but there are many more materials and molds out there to create anything from door knockers to swords. Okay, we have... Okay, and then a sickle mold. What do we do? Ah! Oh. Now you need to cool it to make it durable. Hold down the left mouse button to plunge the sickle in and let go. When you see the arrows hit the target line, it moves fast, so be ready. Uh, whoa! Now you just need to set your flexibility in the forge. Hold left mouse button to improve, improve flexibility. The more flexibility you have, the easier it will be when it comes to the anvil. All right, uh, okay, pretty good. Now you need to hammer the sickle on the anvil. Press left mouse button when the hammer passes over the target to hit it. Having higher flexibility in the previous forge stage means a slower moving hammer. Each time you successfully hit a target, your durability rises. Accurate strikes are the key. Whoa! Okay, there we go. Whoa! Boom! Boom! Oh, this minigame is cool! Well done! Now grind the item to sharpen it. Hold left mouse button to start the grinding process and let go to stop the markers on the line. One for each side, so try to be accurate on both. Okay. Eh. Not bad, not bad! Used by serial killer. <laughs> yes, we did it! I did it! Well done! You will make a fine smith. If you want to do an apprenticeship, then just talk to me. You are welcome to start any time, but you do need to provide the ore. I will pay you per item you make. One day you might even make something as great as the hammer my father gave me as an heirloom. I daren't use it, as it is so precious. Oh, we can do an apprenticeship? I want to do an apprenticeship. Great, well like I said, if you provide the ore, then you can make as much as you want. Come talk to me when you've made anything, and I'll pay you per item. We're an apprentice! Great stuff, you made your first item in a blacksmith. I feel you could become really good at this in time. Maybe one day you might even own your own smithing business. I wanna. Oh, a shovel mold. Yes, let's make a shovel. Cool, we can make it ourselves. Okay, tin, shovel. 
Oh, that was bad. Well, can't be perfect every time. There we go. Yay! I have a shovel. I guess you don't need to grind a shovel. Ooh, can we do an apothecary apprenticeship? Oh, the billboard! Let's see if anyone needs help. Ooh, okay. Hugs are fine, but some sort of gift wouldn't go amiss. Urgently required at Willowdone Farm by Dad. Oh, Dad wanted us to see this. Okay. Pig racing, pig market, dropped something. Teresa Green lost to Nadia statue in Jurita's Cross. Okay. Big request. Toby's after the following. I can do that. Item wanted. Hazelnut wants a carrot seed. Jurita day. Okay. Uh, let's just add everything. <laughs> what have you got for me? Hmm. I do need a carrot seed. So I'll take that. Now, what else is in here? Slingshot. Glass jar. Night milk. Flour. Yeah, let's buy some flour. Ball. Tin bucket. Dorita statue. Glass jar. Let's buy a glass jar. Just to see. And, uh, let's bounce. I want to see if we can do anything in the apothecary. I liked the blacksmith mini game. I want to see what else we can do. Oh, oh, grave lilac. Sorry, I don't have that. Favor, basil. Okay, can't use this. Aww. You can sell stuff here? Uh, okay, let me. Uh, I'll sell some pears. Sell price, two brass. Alright, does anyone. Does anyone want to buy? Please? Nobody's here. Hello? <gasps> Customer! You guys want some pears? I've got pears. Hey! I'm making money. Thanks for that. Now I'm leaving. <laughs> Hazel! Where have you been? I've been looking for you! Freaking cat lady? Wait. Oh, thank you! You must be a true cat lover! Would you like to buy one of my cats? Just choose any except little old bubble puff on my head. Can't bear to be without him. Only ten brass each. <gasps> we could get a cat? <gasps> oh, this one looks like my cat! Yes. And we'll name him after my cat, too. Your name is Socks. We have a cat! Oh my goodness, he's so cute! Weather is expected to be mostly windy with a 23% chance of rain. Alright. Four brass. Okay, let us feed the piggy. And then let's go and get ourselves a shop stall. Truffles, you need to move. Alright, we're gonna do it for four hours. And let's see, we have mostly carrots, so, so we're gonna charge five brass. <laughs> let's see what we can make. Oh, barter skill. Oh, got it. Nice. Yes, I do have a little cat. He's very handsome and he's mine, not yours. Boom. Boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 
Meow. Meow. Capitalism will rise up! Hey, no talking! Buy or leave! See, this lady gets it. You know what? Just for shits and giggles, we're gonna sell our carrots for 34 brass. Let's see what happens. Do you want a carrot? That's a silly price, I'm not paying that. Dang it, they thought about this! Meow. Meow. Alright, I'm leaving. I want to buy wheat seeds. How much? One brass? Okay, we'll get one of those. And what have you got? Carrot seeds. We'll buy more of those. Anyone else selling? Oh, what have you got? Carrot seeds. I already have those, but I'll buy another. And is that it? Oh, there's someone over here. What are you selling? Carrots? I should have guessed. Okay. Let's summon truffles. And go get our dog. Doggy! <laughs> You're coming with me. Yes, sausage, you are mine. And you know what? I'm not a fan of sausage, but I am a fan of salami. So let's get salami. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. <laughs> Look at me with my crew. Truffles, salami, and socks. Oh, what's up, bud? What's up, buddy? Oh, a dig spot. One sec. Equipment. Shovel. Okay. Okay, dig. Woof woof! What's up, good boy? Okay, everyone get out of the way! Okay, dig. 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 Maybe if I stand over it. Dig. Ooh! Ooh, okay. Wait. To win at this minigame, you get a number of taps based on the quality of your spade. Each tap reveals a number of how close you are to, correct, to the correct digging spot without using diagonals to reach. After placing the taps, you then have to dig at a square. Success will take you to the next depth or to a reward depending on where you, one might be. Failure with, will collapse the hole and mean you have to try again at a different location. Okay. Uh, okay. So one, two, two... Ah! Dig success! Found a bone! Creepy, but probably what your dog has been after. <gasps> Do you want your bone? Alright, let's get some planting. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Four, and boop, boop, boop. Oh, it would look perfect if it weren't for that. Okay, watering can. Water, 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 water. Oh no, wait, I don't want to water the wheat. Watch out, salami. Don't want you to get soaked. Wet dog smell is a bad smell. That's why you guys aren't growing. I forgot to water you. Here we are. Oh, where's socks? Not much for you to do today. If you are at a loose end, you can always explore or even create a task for yourself. Look at your task list and there is a create a task option. Now you can make your own entertainment. That's cool, but I've been up all day, Dad. <laughs> New letter in the mailbox? Oh, a gift from Father. Dear Robin, your friendship means a lot to me, so I'm sending you this gift as a thank you. Warm regards, father. I mean, you're my dad. Surf and turf. Ooh. What else we got? A letter from Lucy Arrows. Hello, I was wondering if you can help me. I am in need of a brave and adventurous young soul, and I think you fit the quill quite nicely. Plus, you live nearby. Meet me tonight anytime after 6pm at the Henge of Northgate, not far from my house. Bring a lantern. Kind regards, Lucy Arrows. Ooh. Let's go. Oh no, <laughs> oh, socks was stuck. Oh, you got my letter and came. That's so great of you. 
I absolutely adore history and lore. For years I have studied this henge and have not unlocked its secrets. I personally believe it is a gateway to where the Fey live. I came across an old tomb that mentioned shining a light at it. Would you try focusing your lantern beam on the henge while I watch for any signs of magic? Perhaps try standing on the circle and turn on your lantern, then use the right click stick or move your mouse cursor away to focus the beam. Okay. Let's try. Okay, uh, toggle? Oh, okay. Hmm, that doesn't seem to be it. I will tr keep trying to transcribe the book to see if there are any special requirements. Thank you for your help. Here's five brass for your trouble. Girl, I sell carrots for that much. Do you want a carrot for your troubles? Oh, that's probably blinding. <laughs> that's such a cool mechanic. Okay, we will pick this up next time. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please consider subscribing and leaving a like. One like equals one pet for truffles, salami, and socks. Remember to take care of yourselves, and I will see you next time.